next stop Paris, La City. It's the longest leg of the journey. Amazing city. Every city we've been to has been amazing. Um, I, look, I just look forward to meeting people yet again. This is Wolf. Ta da! Local uh, tracer. Um, just got met him when he was over here. Um, from Marseille. Yeah, from Marseille, of course. From Marseille. Not from, you know, Paris. But uh, yeah, so Scott. Um, Gave him a little call last night and said, you know, come and meet up, show us around. So he's been uh, been uh, showing us around the locations today, which is uh, very nice. In Paris, we are in the La Défense, uh, one of the main spots uh, in Paris. And uh, La Défense is a big spot where you can find uh, many things like that, but not uh, just in this place. Yeah. It's a big place uh, where you can't stop to move. Fascinating. So there's a lot to do around here. Uh, seems as a, a place where a lot of people, uh, after work or during break, just come to chill. You can literally start a mile over that way and just continue to run the whole way, which is really, really cool because you don't come across many locations like that where you can just continue the whole way, really. So it's a lot of fun. I just want to, to move, just want to live, just want to express what I, what I have on, on my heart. Through the parkour, through the free running. And uh, to show to everybody that where you will, I will. Even if I'm a little guy. It was the end of the, the, uh, the tour near enough and I was just there taking the views and just the people in. There was a... Uh, <laughs> A great feeling of, of just relief that people were just moving and not much was going on and people were just enjoying the time. It's good to be outdoors, it's good to help people, it's good to be able to share with people your views on life and if they can take anything from that then, you know, it's fantastic. Just here in France, different people are teaching different way of seeing the discipline. Some are really showing off, some are really secret. In every country, you have some, some style, you know, like French, French style, English style. You um, create some moves in your country. And uh, when you see other people from other countries, say, oh, they, they do this like this, and I never do this like this. So you can, uh, you can learn and you can teach, and it's very good, I think. We have uh, something that uh, I think that we have for, for all our life in parkour. The spirits, the family spirit, friendly spirit, because when you need something, when you are uh, in front of the wall and you are scared, it's, it's, a, it's not a collective sport. But when you turn, you can see many people who say, go, 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 you can do it, you can do it. The part is that. It's been a difficult three weeks. There's been ups and downs, but we've, we've all made it through in one piece. And that's the most important thing, that we're all together still. Sebastian told me that uh, David was about, and you know it'd be it'd be cool to meet up with him. <laughs>